dolly, my dolly, I was sixteen when they told me I had something everybody wanted. Everything must be easy. And to enjoy it. it while it lasted. That pretty face of yours won't last forever. Give it a few years and you won't be so picky. A cruel thing to tell a child, really. I was twenty-five when I walked to the edge of the cliff. They made me feel like I was decaying before I even knew who I was. And I wondered if the abyss would be gentler than time. You know, that haunting feeling when you look to the sea and wonder what lurks beneath the surface. <laughs> No, you wouldn't know, but I did. I felt the same way looking at my face in the mirror. Eliza, the carriage leaves in ten I'm minutes. coming, Mother. Wondering what creature lurked beneath the fragile veil of youth, and when she would come to the surface to devour me alive. Well, here I am, Dolly. I am that creature, <laughs> that girl I was, I sucked the life from her, I chewed on her bones, ate her from within. <laughs> so they say, a horrifying tale truly, if it was true, it was not time that punished me, it was the people. They made me believe that all would be lost the day I looked in the mirror and saw this face. They now believe this loneliness of mine is my punishment when truly it is a blessing. I am finally free and I see their words for what they are. You know, darling, one day they will see me for the last time on that cliff overlooking the sea. They will say all sorts of kind and empty words about my selfless and tragic existence, then turn to the young girls and make me a cautionary tale. If she had been more humble, maybe what? she wouldn't have You want to die like alone that. like that old lighthouse hag? You're not even that pretty. All alone with know that I left because I had to, because we all have to. Do not look into the abyss with fear, but with wonder. It is there to welcome you, not to cast you away like this wretched earth. I will be there, darling, looking 